<clears throat> yeah, AJ, I, I just wondered, you know, what did you say over the last few weeks as you had a handful of kind of uncharacteristic drops, those kind of started to accumulate and did today, today feel like sort of, <laughs> I don't mean to start with a negative thing, it's, it's, it's leading to a positive, did today feel like your answer to that? Uh, I mean, I think you caught every, every uh, pass basically on your way. No, uh, today, uh, like every other day, my mindset going to the game, catch up every opportunity. Um, today was a day where I put it all together. I caught every target. I went, I wasn't really too focused on the drops then. Uh, I looked at them like it's a part of the game. I'm not trying to drop the ball. That's like, that's kind of stupid. I'm not going out there trying to drop the ball. But. Yeah, for you to get 1K and, and Derek to get 2K, is, is pretty clear that there's balance on offense. How unstoppable does that, does that make you guys? Um, I want like I want to say the word unstoppable, but uh, it definitely we definitely feed off each other, and I benefit off him, you know. So uh, he's doing his thing back there. They they gotta at least acknowledge him, and then they give me more opportunities when they do that. So uh, we feed off each other, try to be unstoppable. Yeah. But. And then on that on that catch, the fifty-two yarder, were you surprised at how open the the, the middle of the field was? No, uh, I knew exactly where he was coming to me. Um, I, we saw quarters. I, I knew as soon as I lined up, I hope they don't roll the cover three. Um, if they did, I was going to still keep it real skinny. Uh, but uh, I knew as soon as I, I lined up that I was getting it. Emily? So you got 2,000 for, for Derek and, and 1,000 for you. I mean, just how much credit, though, do you give the guy, you know, under center and in, in, um, in your quarterback, Ryan Tannehill, uh, for, for getting you both to that to that? He get all the credit. He get all the credit. Uh, I can't. I can't throw it to myself. <laughs> so he gonna get all the credit. Like the last play, that was a dime. He dropped it in the bucket. They gave me an opportunity. You know. So uh, he gets all the credit. Every every, every catch. Every, everything. And how important was it for you to go back out there after you know you, you fell down early with an injury, but to to finish the game and to finish it in the way that you did? How important was it for you to go back out there? Um. Not to talk about myself, but just the toughness I come I come with, uh, find a way when there's no way. Um, didn't know how I was going to finish the game if you would asked me uh, on, on that play early in the game. Uh, but uh, just finding a way. You know, uh, we got the week. I'm not – we don't want to talk about injuries, but, you know, but you just got to find a way, I mean, at the end of the day. <laughs> AJ, uh you guys had a big lead, and obviously there was a, there was a chance to blow it open. In, in the moment, is it fun to be in a tense back and forth game like that? Pa, this, pa, this ain't no video game, pa. <laughs> 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 no, you know, uh, <laughs> I'm not. We're not trying to go back and forth like that. You know, uh, you know, uh, it's the NFL. Like you never know. You got to keep going. You know, uh, anything can change at any moment. Man, you got that's why you gotta keep your foot on the pedal. So uh it was it was definitely tough, but we, KB, you guys came need out to clean it. up some things on defense, obviously. Thank you. Players often say you get a fresh Hey AJ. Um I know uh hope uh, you haven't answered this yet, but uh, I know the ankle's been bothering you and nagging at you for a few weeks. Um Talk, can you talk about kind of the mind over matter when it comes to the game and, and especially on that long pass there near the end? Uh, uh, did, did you think about the ankle at all? It looked like you're moving pretty well on that. <laughs> uh, nah, uh, my mindset, find a way when there's no way. Uh, find a way to win. That's, that's what I tell myself. It is what it is. If I get banged up, uh, unfortunately, to go back out there, I'm going to go back out there. You know, it's it just it's just another one. I, I hurt when it's over. You know, we'll figure out figure out what I'm gonna do when it's all done, said and done. But while I'm out here, my way get a reward from it. AJ, okay. I'm bouncing over late. Just when the ball's in flight and and it's coming your way, kind of what's going through your mind uh, at that moment, and and to come down with it, knowing you're in field goal range, how good of a feeling was that? Um, to be honest, I saw the I, I really didn't see the ball. 
and it kind of surprised me. I'm uh, glad I, I ran out the, out the cut. When I saw the ball, I was like, make sure you get to this ball, get to this ball. Uh, if I had to lay out, I, I was going to. Uh, but he threw, a, he threw a great ball. He dropped it in the bucket. He threw it early, gave me a chance to run on it. Uh, so, yeah. And, and as far as the feeling of winning, you want you guys have won two games in overtime this year. You've won some tight ones since you've been in the league. But the exuberance when you win and the ball goes off the crossbar and you're winning AFC South and guys are running all over the field, when's the last time you've had an experience like that from an, an emotional standpoint? Never had an experience like that. Never won a championship or nothing like that in college. I won, I won a championship in high school, but you know, this time, this time it really it means more, you know. Uh, it was a crazy, crazy ending. I think the kicker called bank. <laughs> so, uh, yeah.